Hey guys, my name is Freddie. I'm a site engineer with Fulton Hogan Utilities. First 12 months of a grad, um, it was a little bit out of the ordinary because I started in the middle of the year um, and didn't really get to join the cohort um, of 2019. But I was able to join back in um, 2020 with a new cohort and it was a great experience, honestly. Um, it's just all thanks to the, like Fulton Hogan's family culture. Like everyone I met, they were just very friendly and supportive ever since day one. First day on site, they hook you up with a mentor, which was a very good decision for me because like I came on site and I didn't read, and there was like a lot of acronyms being thrown around like, oh, get the EWP, um, the MTP and things like that. And I was just like, I don't know what this means. But the, having a mentor guide you through this whole process and having someone to bounce ideas off was, a, um, was very helpful for me transitioning from the university into the graduate program and delivering projects out on the field. The biggest learning curve um, that I found was that in university you're always given like ideal problems um, with fixed solutions but out in the real world man, you just need to be practical really um, just provide, help provide creative solutions and or innovative solutions um, that are practical to help solve the, the to put out the fire then and there rather than trying to find something perfect. In the first year, I think from memory, there was the graduate development framework, which is basically um, which helps you provide the building blocks to all the new graduates. Um, to ve develop a very strong foundation from the beginning so that they're able to take that on once they become a site engineer or whatever profession that they choose to go with um, at the end of the program. Uh, there's a lot of internal and external training um, that Fulton Hogan provide and are very supportive for you to do. And if you do choose to go towards um, chartership, they also definitely recommend that as well. show a bit of enthusiasm and initiative and having a strong ability to communicate with other people because day in and day out we're talking with clients, vendors and a whole different bunch of people at different levels and you have to be able to be flexible with the way that you communicate so that your messages can get across in the most efficient way so that you can all come um, up with a set, the same solution. <laughs>